Hey guys, my name is Lisa, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a football braid. So it's basically looks like this, and you can wear this many different ways, but I just did it in a side ponytail for video purposes, and it's easier to do on yourself because you can actually see with like a mirror in front of you. Um, by the way, yes, this is my first YouTube video, so hope you like it. So let's get started. The things you will need will be two ponytails, an elastic, and a brush. You can also use a teasing comb or just regular comb for volume, but that's part just optional, so yeah. So first you'll need to brush out your hair. Mm -hmm. Awkward brushing hair. Mm -hmm. Okay, my hair is already brushed. Okay. So, next, what you're going to do is you're going to pull your hair to um, a ponytail that you want. You can do it like up here or something. Or also, you can like put it right here, and then after, you can like bring it up and it'll look casual, but there will be a football on your head. So, um, I'm just going to pull all my hair to this side since this side already has bangs and pizzazz. Um, okay, so. <laughs> Stuff is going wrong. Okay. So now you're just going to put this elastic to a side pony. And optional, you can tease your hair. Just to make, you know, uh, more voluminous, as you might say. So, but I don't want to really do that. So, I'm just going to put my hair in a side ponytail. Okay, next part. Now you're just going to separate a little piece of hair, like an inch of hair, like about that much, and you're just going to take your little elastic, tie it up, and put it to the side. Okay, so now what you're going to do is you're just going to make a regular um, fishtail braid. If you don't know how to do that, then um, all you do is like, is you just split your hair into two parts, and you're just going to take one little piece of hair and then switch it onto the other inner side and then I'm just going to take another little piece of hair from this side and put it over to the other side so it's very continuous but um, you'll get through it okay now once you've done that you're just going to take another ponytail and just tie it um, pretty loosely I guess but like not too loose so like, what about there? And then you're just going to separate and loosen up your fish tail. And you'll want to do this a lot because this is going to be the base of the football and footballs are pretty flat and big. Well, like the picture of it. So you just want to like really pull it apart. So um, I think that's good. Uh, but you could do it more if you want. So I'm going to stop right here. And um, now this is where the little tails that you made come in. So you'll just want to remove the elastic that you put there from earlier. And you'll just want to split it into three parts. And then you'll just want to do a regular braid. Okay, so now what you're gonna do once you've finished your regular braid to your desired length, it's gonna be it's gonna need to be um pretty like a decent amount longer than your uh, football fishtail braid. So you're just going to take the middle one, which we're gonna use this one, and you're just gonna take the other two strands and lift them up and make a snake braid. It's like push it all the way up, and that is basically a snake braid and you can like push out the other tail that got left out. So now what you can do is you can just like pull it down and just spread out all the snake. So you can probably, you can't probably see it, but um, this is basically what a snake braid looks like. It's like a snake running down the middle piece. So um, now what you're going to do is you're going to take that little elastic once again 
and you're just going to tie it off again. Okay, so now that you've got your snake braid and your fishtail braid, you're going to combine them together. So um, you can always, you know, adjust your snake braid to make all the squigglies, like the big squiggly, squigglies going to the middle. So that's what I'm going to do. And um, then you're just going to carefully take out the bottom piece of your fishtail. And then take out the snake braid one. Now this can get tricky because you're holding on to two different ones and one of them is not the same length as the other so you're just gonna like take your other ponytail hold it and then try and hold together all the pieces as best as you can and then try and tie it all together okay now as you can see the braid kind of unraveled from the snake so you can just like pull up the little pieces from the ponytail, like from down here, just like tug on it, and then just like bring the other ones down to make it look a little bit more uniform. Okay, and now what you're going to do since your fishtail probably got unraveled a little bit, you're just going to tug on it once more. Now you can bobby pin this down so it doesn't separate from there, but um, I'm not going to do that just for, you know, video sake. Um, you can, like I said at the beginning of the video, you can like put it right here, like a low ponytail, and then bring it up and there will be a football on your head. Um, you can also do that. Uh, so yeah, that's basically the football braid and um, that's end of the video. Okay, awkward ending. So um, this is the end of the video. And, uh, yeah, if you like this and found it, I guess, somewhat cute, then give it a like and subscribe if you want to. I only have one video, but subscribe if you want to. Um, so, yeah. Bye!